You will now see how to activate and review the access and error logs for your host through your control panel. You will be able to complete this process in a few quick steps. I will now show you how to do this. First, you will need to log into your control panel. Do this by clicking the control panel login link located in the upper right corner of the page. Next enter your login details in the username and password fields of the members area login form. First is your username. And then the password. Now click the login button to go straight to your control panel. You will now see how to navigate to the access and error logs section of your control panel. As soon as you log into the web hosting control panel, click on the access and error logs icon located in the live stats section. This is where you can keep track of your access and error logs from. Ok, you are done with the open access log procedure. Now let's see how to activate the access and error logs tool. In the access logs panel, you will be able to activate access and error logs for each one of your hosts. To do this, simply click and mark the checkbox of the host that you wish to enable access and error logs tracking for. You can select one of your hosts, or all of them, depending on your particular needs. As soon as you are done with your selection, click the apply button to confirm it. The green pop-up message will confirm for you that the access and error logs have been activated successfully for the selected hosts. You will need to allow up to one hour for the web server to update the changes online. OK, we have now activated the access logs feature. I will now show you how to review them. Back in the access and error logs table, you will first have to decide which host you wish to view the statistics for, and then go and click on the access logs clip icon, corresponding to that particular host. This will download for you the access and error logs for this file. Once downloaded, the access logs can be opened with any text editing software, including Notepad. The comprehensive information contained in the text file will allow you to see from which particular IP addresses your hosting account and websites are accessed, as well as what their host names are and what user agents are used. You can check the access logs for each one of your hosts in the same way. Well that's it, now you know how to activate and check the access and error logs for your web hosting account through your control panel.